Hi and welcome to Planet Pash playing The Walking Dead. Episode status? Yeah, let's do episode... Oh, okay. Let's, let's, let's play. Yeah. The Walking Dead is a game by Telltale Games and it's based on the comic. The comic which the TV series is also based on. Okay, so choose a display style. Standard. More help from UI and feedback when you make important choices. Minimal. Turn off UI hints, help, and choice notifications. Huh. This is actually a pretty interesting decision. Do I want help or do... Okay. Wait. Oh, so... It doesn't show me what, what I can use when I use uh, minimal. Let's do standard first. I can change it afterwards. Uh, episode 1. A new day. Yeah, let's start a new day. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The game is tailored by how you play. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Uh, um... Uh, why do you say that? Uh... Yeah. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Every time? Every time. We got what looks like a 1091E here for the X-25. Wow. Let's look at the rear view mirror. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. So you've got an opinion. You've got an opinion then? Wouldn't say that. I go in for that innocent till proven guilty thing, even considering who they say you kill. He advised uh, medical personnel and route to heart seal, various tests of 20 coming in. I just turned on the subtitles. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Mm, sure. Sure. So, how do you see Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Yeah, I don't know. Could be, yeah. lot going on in the city. Uh... Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over, right where you sit. Officers are available for incoming 
Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Uh, so, yeah, did he do it? So did he do it? <clears throat> they caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Wow. It goes to show, people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Watch out! Oh shit! Holy fuck! Wow! I did totally not expect that. Holy crap! Oh, wow. doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. He's not moving. Oh, shit. So I guess it's... Ooh, a shotgun! Why the hell did he have his gun out? Maybe it was tossed from the car during the wreck. I don't think so. He must have the handcuff keys on him. He must have the handcuff keys on him. Yeah, great. So, how do I get out of the... Oh. Once more. And once more. And once more. Yes! Very good. Ooh. Um... The... Uh, open. That shotgun. I want the shotgun. Take it. Looks empty. Oh, why? It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Huh, I get it. Wow, your old leg looks like it really hurts. You poor guy. Officer? God damn. Officer? He's dead. He is. Take the keys and... Unlock the handcuffs. Oh, great. Man, that got to hurt. And, uh, this one as well. Officer. Whoa! Oh, shit! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Yep, I'm looking! Yep, what in the hell? Exactly that. Uh, get away! Get the shotgun! Get the shotgun! Take it! Yep! 
and now the shotgun. And now load the shotgun with the bullet. Exactly. Do that. Oh, no. Take it. Take it. Hurry up. Now shoot them fuck out of him. Bastard. I kind of liked him, though. Shit. Yep. His skin's all rotten and he smells like shit. What the hell is this? It's a zombie, all right. Are you dead? Hey! Are you dead? Uh... He... Does look like he is. So what do I do now? Hello? You'll stand up again, right? Ah. Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! Hey, don't walk away, you bitch! Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Shit. Oh. Oh. Shit. Oh, damn it. Run away. Faster. Oh, God. So many zombies. Um, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Hurry! Get over the fence! Run! I'm sorry, I know you can't run, but do it anyway! Oh, god damn it. Oh, shit. Wow, that guy is wasting his ammo. But he did kind of help me, so thanks, guy who's wasting his ammo. For for wasting your ammo. Oh, god damn it. Hello? Anybody? Hmm. Huh. So you're good again? I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. You would fill one of those teacups with some I'd bourbon? Fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. How can you think of bourbon Help! when some zombies just No ladder. <laughs> I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg way it is. Yeah, I guess so. Huh. Yep. This luck definitely sucks. I mean, I'm sorry. I think it... Uh, I get it that you think it's a nice luck, but I think that sucks. Somebody! Yell if you can hear me! Maybe I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Yep, maybe I should do that. Well, if the plot demands it, I will do it. Yeah, open it. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Ah, uh, just open it. Oh, of course it's locked. Oh, it isn't. Coming in! Don't shoot, okay? Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. One of them. Oh, God. These it's... people might need more help than I do. This is not good. Oh, no.
Is there a kid in here? It's fake. Damn. What? Maybe there's something on there. Yeah. Use it then. Three new messages. Message one. Left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. And they're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Oh, God. Daddy? What? The kid. Where is it? Is it in there? Hey! Kid! Open! Okay, it's probably not in there. Ooh, a walkie-talkie. Might want to pick it up. Hello? You need to be quiet. Oh. It's the kid. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me. But I'm hiding until my parents come home. Oh, God. I don't think they're gonna come home, kid. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, God. You're Clementine. How old How are you? How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. You're Clementine, What's your right? name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Ah, oh, it's you. Oh god, oh no! Oh. Uh, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill, kill that bitch, kill her! Ugh. One of the knives, take one of the- oh! Yup! Uh. Kick that bitch! Oh no! Kick her! Kick her! Oh god, she got a hammer! Oh shit! Kill her! Kill her! Kick! 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 Kick again! Kick the hammer! Once more! Oh God! Holy crap! Man! Hi there! Wow! Thanks, kid. Oh God! This. Did you kill it? Yes. Yes. Something else did. No, yes, yes, I did kill it. It's okay. I think she was a monster. She was. Yeah, I think so, too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. 
I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Yeah, come with me. What should we do now? Uh... Get out of we here. We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come oh, home. What? Wait. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. Did I just that say that I good. want to wait until we can night? Hide in my tree. Okay, let's try this one more time. I saw a lot in the forest, but that was a while ago. Yeah, one we're looking for is still in the neighborhood. Oh shit, you hurt your leg pretty bad. Look, yeah. help us find the thing that got our buddy, and we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's farm to safety. He should be able to fix your leg up too. I'm not a dad. I'm... I'm just some guy. Just some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Whoever you are, let's get a move on. We just were. Oh. Oh shit. It's Chad. Shoot. Shoot the bitch. Yo, get to my car. Yeah, Go. why. 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 Why are you shooting him? Shoot him. Shoot him. Oh god damn it. Just shoot him. Why didn't he shoot him? I don't know, if that were my buddy, I would have shot him. Even if it was my buddy. Seriously. Oh, pussy. Oh, he got a police computer. It's not looking good. Oh, I don't think they're gonna send me to prison. But hey, Sean noticed what I said, that Say I'm just some dad. guy. Yeah. I'm sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. Take care, you two. Gonna well, do. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of Atlanta, and, uh... Chet, he got killed. No, you're kidding. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You've brought a couple guests. Mm. We, we need a place to stay. Need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. So it's just you and your daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. No. Oh. Okay, then. Well, looks Thanks. like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Thank you. <clears throat> Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Hurts, it like, hurts hell. like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? I, I didn't. It. Well, now's the time. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Just, just uh, out for a drive. Oh, I'm not doing so good, huh? We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl? A police officer. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. 
House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. Well, he doesn't seem to remember that she's not my your name, daughter. Darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Well, I like the guy. Um, looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. But what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. It's not. It smells like... I know what it smells like. <laughs> Duty. Duty. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Poor girl. Oh, I do not like the sound of that. I love you, baby. <laughs> oh, nightmares. <laughs> oh. Shit. Get up. <sighs> oh, I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your Ooh. daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? <laughs> That's a valuable treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. Is that her mom? Word is, His you mom. were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Hmm, sure. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Huh. Let's, let's go talk to the lady. Hey there, girls. Hmm. You two actually look relaxed. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. So, you good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? It is. Uh, what do you do? So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale, like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh, uh, no, I used to. No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well... I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Yeah. Katya learned that you were fired. Well... So... So what? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and... 
We just passed people over some. Just, just... No, uh, it's okay. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow. But even then, I can't take away the things we... The things Doc went through. No, he... Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Uh... It was bad before. Things were bad before. Bad now, but the different, you see? People are eating each other. I'm sorry. But they weren't before. The banks, the politics, the, the crap. Those things are gone. Hell comes in a lot of different colors. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Uh, great. Thanks. Thanks for remembering that. I bet she's gonna remember it until she dies. Because she's a woman. Women all... all, all I don't care what she does. Here. Hey there. Uh, Kenny. Hi, Kenny. How you doing? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Hmm. I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. Hmm. How's Duck doing? How's your son doing? Good, I think. kachi has got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Well, apparently nothing's gonna phase Duck. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. <laughs>